Supreme made this hoodie, so we made this tutorial. Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. My name is Sabrina and today our tutorial is all about motion blur. We were so inspired when we saw the Supreme motion blur hoodie. We decided we had to make a tutorial on it. So here we are. Let's jump right into it. All right, so once we've opened up Adobe Illustrator, what we're gonna do is go right into our toolbar and click on our text tool. Then we're gonna type out the word Supreme, click Command A on our keyboard to select it all, then move over into our properties panel on the right side, and there you're gonna have your character options, you can select your font here and make it bigger, and then you're gonna go into your align panel and you're gonna center it to the artboard. Making sure you're still selected on your text, you're gonna hold down the option key on your keyboard and drag out a couple copies. All right, so for the first layer copy, we're just gonna leave it the way it is and just bring down the opacity to about 50%. For the other copies, we're gonna remove some of the letters, bring down the opacity again, and then just put them into place. So selecting on one of your layer copies, what we're gonna do is open up our appearance panel. So here we're gonna create a new fill and we are gonna select the drop down menu and click on the gradient option. Then still in our toolbar, we're gonna go to our gradient panel. In there, you can customize your own gradient. Then in the top left, if you click down on the color drop down menu, you can create your own swatch. I named it Supreme. And then I'm gonna go back into all my layer copies and change their fill to the swatch I just made. Now, going back to our appearance panel, we are gonna add a Gaussian blur to each layer other than the first one. So you can find this effect at the bottom left corner where it says FX, there's a drop down menu and Gaussian blur is listed there. And once you are happy with that, what we're gonna do is select the whole thing, copy and paste it into Photoshop. Now, when you paste something into Photoshop, it automatically gives you some options. So here, we're gonna select Smart Object and hit OK. So here, I'm gonna adjust the size and bring it to the middle of my artboard. Heading over to the Layers panel, I'm going to make a bunch of duplicate copies, hitting Command J on my keyboard. So what I'm gonna do is turn the view off on all of my layers and I am gonna leave the top one on, make sure I'm selected on it, go to the top menu bar. In filter, you're gonna find the blur dropdown and we are gonna select motion blur. To make the first layer really blurry and every layer under it a little less blurry. Now, once you've done all that, it's gonna look a little crazy, but don't worry, we're gonna mask out half of it. So we're gonna create a mask on each layer, and then I am just taking out the left side of the blur because that's how it appears in the hoodie. And once you're happy with all your adjustments, you are done. And that is a wrap to another video. If you did like this one, please don't forget to subscribe and like below. I will see you guys next time in our next one. Have a fantastic week. Bye guys.